Welcome back to SourceFed, I'm Matt Lieberman. And I'm Trisha Hirschberger. Do you live for cutting edge science and the dream of traveling to Mars? If so, you can thank the all new 2015 Subaru Legacy for making this video possible. Mars fans rejoice. After a 10 month, 442 million mile journey, NASA's Mars Atmosphere and Volatile Evolution, or MAVEN space probe, finally entered orbit around Mars late last night. After firing its engines for 33 straight minutes, MAVEN slowed down enough to be captured by Mars's gravity. Unlike previous rover missions, such as Curiosity, Spirit, and Opportunity, Maven will not land on the planet, but instead study the planet's atmosphere from orbit. I'd make a stalking joke, but, you know, mustache. Yeah, don't do that. Scientists designed MAVEN to ask questions about what happened to Mars' atmosphere. Why is it so thin now? What's happened to the planet's moisture? How do gases present now in the atmosphere interact with solar wind? Hopefully we'll find an answer to all of them. But first, following a six week period of activating MAVEN systems one by one, the probe will first turn its attention to a comet known as Siding Spring as it flies close to Mars. Now, I've always loved comets, so <laughs> this is the coolest news in my book. Also significant in this story is that MAVEN reached Mars three days earlier than India's competing Mars satellite, which launched a full two weeks earlier than MAVEN did nearly a year ago. Now this should do nothing to diminish the significance of India's mission, which would place it firmly in the Asian space exploration conversation. So folks, are you excited about the potential discoveries that MAVEN can bring back to Earth? Let us know down in the comments below. And if you're in the mood for more eye-opening discoveries, you can check out the cool things that our good friend Patrick Norton is doing to put the 2015 Subaru Legacy through its paces over on SubaruLegacyChallenge.com. I'm Matt Lieberman. And I'm Trisha Hershberger. So, what's Stash? the verdict? I vote no, no. I I vote yes. But yes. it's not up to me. You do what you want with your face. I know. I didn't like it at first, but the more I see it, the more I'm like, oh, hey there, handsome. I think you should shave one side so it's not symmetrical and mm -hmm. it just looks a little crooked. A little lopsided? Yeah. I'm thinking maybe I'll just do a reverse Hitler and I'll just shave this part so it's just these. I'll, I will go back to you do what you want with your face. Okay. <laughs>